Assalamu alaikum dear students. Uh, since we are working from online, from time to time you still have to submit your assignments. So today I'm going to teach you how to convert your handwritten assignments into the PDF format. So for this one we need a special app called the Adobe Scan. So this uh, Adobe Scan is a mobile application available for Android or the iOS. So all you have to do, uh, let me show you, you have to go to the uh, market, right? The, in my case I'm using Android, Android market, and search for the Adobe Scan. And this is the app that we are looking for, as you can see, the Adobe Scan uh, PDF Scanner. Uh, I already installed the app. You have to go through the installation procedure and then just click the app. So when you open, uh, open the app for the first time, you have to go through the login procedure. I already log in. I'm already using the app. So the, when I open the app, I just go directly to the, the scanning mode. So as you can see, so sorry, one more time. So when I open the app, it's already in a scan mode. So all I have to do, I just point the, the camera towards my notes, right? And click the camera button. Okay. So when you click the camera button, you can see this uh, blue frame. So this frame is actually the uh, frame of the scan region, right? So you can adjust this. If you don't like the, if you don't want to scan the whole document or let's say that something is missing, you can change manually with your hands. Okay. So you can adjust this blue region. As you can see, I'm adjusting it right now. Okay, if you think something is missing, you can adjust it manually. Or you can just click the uh, retake button here. You can just click the retake button and try to the, scan the image again. Otherwise, you just click the continue. Okay, so let's go to the next page. Instead of clicking the, the button here, you can just wait. So if you just wait enough, the Adobe will capture the region automatically. Okay, so right now I didn't click anything and it uh, scanned the automatically. But the as you can see, there are some extra here. For example, on the left side, I have some binders. So I don't need this one in my document. So I can just, again, the, adjust the corners manually, right? So I don't want anything extra to be in my PDF file. Okay, so I just click the continue, go to the next page, right? So for example, this is my next page. I just point towards the document and click the camera button again. So if I click the camera button, okay, let's wait for the result. And again, the, this is my result. So I can just adjust a little bit the corners. Okay. So the useful tip for this one is actually to scan your documents on a black background. So if you have the white paper, try to use the dark background. In this case, the scan uh, result will be much more clear. But otherwise, it's okay. You can adjust manually as I did right now. So I just click the continue button. And when I click, now you can see on the corner, the uh, the bottom corner you can see the number of pages I already scanned so I just click this file uh, sorry I just click this button on the corner okay one second and you can see my document right so this is the PDF document that we scan right now so you can go through the pages that's it if you want to add more pages you just click the add page uh, button at the left corner at the bottom left corner otherwise you just click the save pdf so i will click the save pdf button and my pdf is ready okay so now i can share this pdf you can see here the share button or i can just open the file in a uh, acrobat and see my uh, document uh, okay yeah so this is the my scanned pages my assignment so now I can just uh, upload this document to the goals or, or send through the email, etc. Right? So my document is ready. Okay. Thank you everyone for your attention and see you inshallah in the future.